Let's play Psychonauts, episode 55. This is Griffin Lobster. Let's finish this crap. What say you? Yeah, I'm gonna do all this in one recording, actually. I'm gonna do all live commentary, but I might not use all my live commentary. We'll, we'll see how that works. So, yeah. Here it is. The... What I would probably say is the most <laughs> aggravating part of the game. Um... I may be cutting out some of my deaths here, or like speeding up, or you know, you know, just 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 trimming some footage. Uh, here's a tip that somebody actually told me that I've never tried before. You can actually just use invisibility on here, and then go on these tight ropes. Otherwise, uh, your quote-unquote dad would throw those flaming spike pins at you. Um, but you just use invisibility; and he doesn't see. You. I guess that never even crossed my mind. I don't know why. Although really with full health like I have and with regeneration like I have, it's really not that big of a deal. Um, <laughs> you know, you, you know, you get up in high high enough levels. Okay, this platform right here is a checkpoint, so if you die, you'll be back here. If you die beyond this point, uh, you use invisibility. Oh, you butthole. Um. So yeah. This, uh, uh, since I'm doing a huge video like this, the sound quality may not be so great, it may desync, and it may be, you know, kind of jittery, I don't know. I've never done a huge video like this, but, uh, I'm just, oh, you cheater. I'm just letting everybody know. Okay, here we are at what is undisputably the worst part about this section. Now, one thing that I do, sometimes when you jump off these, the double jump doesn't register. Um, so I just hammer the A button. Ooh. <laughs> or whatever the jump button may be. For me, it's the 2 button. And... Oh, that's the hardest one to make, because the fire's near the top of that one. Alright, kill myself. This may be where uh, I start to do some editing here. Uh, yeah, he'll... <laughs> the website has, uh... The Double Fine website, you know, the people who made this game, actually has a bunch of stuff about tips for this, for this whole level. Because they realize that they made it kind of stupidly difficult, but whatever. We'll stop talking about that. That was a terrible jump. Look at that. Yeah, go me. Woo! Because I did practice this before, you know. I was like, well, maybe I should just kind of go into it and get a natural recording. And, I was, and then I thought about that, and I was like, screw that. I'll tell you what it is, it's this cold weather. Chapping my lips and stuff. I hate it! Oh, you're full of crap. Alright, I'm going to come back down here and grab this one. Oh, I missed it again? Well, so much for a good recording. Welcome to, uh... Fail Central. I'll be your guide, Griffin Lobster. You know, I was thinking about my infinite ammo upgrade. I'm never really gonna use that again. Like, I'm not going to use... I'm really, literally not gonna use Side Blast for the rest of the game. Alright, I think that's it. Come on. Alright. This big slab of meat over here is another checkpoint. The second and last checkpoint in this area. Okay. The rest of it shouldn't be too bad. We'll see. I could be totally going to be eating my words here in a bit. Look, there's meat in the bubbles. I always thought that was funny. <laughs> Gotta keep with a the theme, I suppose. Yeah, man, this this dry, dry cold weather, I tell you. Drying my lips out. Make me all cranky, although... I'm not, I don't have any more football games, so I don't have to weather it any, weather the weather, if you will, anymore. That's good. Alright, here you're going to want to zigzag down, dodge his projectiles, otherwise he'll hit you out of the air, and yeah, you will fall in the water. Alright, here you just got to swing past the cleavers here. Not too terrible, I don't think. Could be wrong. That was so dumb, I jumped right into it. So yeah, I guess the cool thing about this level is the parallel between uh, both yours and both Raz's and Oleander's minds. They have problems with their dads in the past, you know. But I guess that's pretty cool. You know, I'm just trying to find the good in this level because it's so difficult. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm determined to finish it this, this video, this whole game, so... I'm just going to keep recording, and that means you're not going to hear my Hey, hey episode, blah, 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 Griffin Lobster, probably at the beginning of the next video. Right. Yeah. Ow. Oh, bullshit. <laughs> I'm sorry, folks. Why do I always head the wrong way in this platform? Frickin'. 
dyslexia or something. No offense to people who have dyslexia. I did it again! I can't believe it! Cleavers of Doom! Oh, not gonna fool me that time, game. Got it this time. That was... The game stole that from me! Stole that... Oh, I'm so cutting so much of this out. You have no idea. Uh, my lips are chapped. Angry. The finals moving over my head. Today's not a good day. Now let's... Let's screw this part up. Oh. Woo! You can jump over these. And he hit me with them. Alright. Okay, pretty much the last thing you have to worry about here is right here, this ladder. If the, if you didn't go fast enough, the water you're going to dip into the water right there. Ooh. And that'll kill you, but it didn't happen. And now I'm home free, because basically you just hold down the control stick. A little cutscene here in just a couple seconds. Dad, I made it! You cheated! No! <laughs> I used the acrobatics you taught me! Don't lie to me, cheater! You crystal ball readers always cheat! You're no son of mine. Yay! Vortex. Oli, are you okay? Where's your dad? He's over there, talking to your dad. He did what? Uh -oh. Somebody's going to get grounded! <laughs> Make that ground! <laughs> get it? Like ground meat. Butcher humor. Okay, so now we have to fight the Butcher again, only now he has flaming cleavers, so we can't hurt him the same way we did last time. Although, it's, he's not any more difficult, I promise. This guy is still a pushover. Really, this game doesn't deliver on final bosses, but whatever. Alright, you need telekinesis for this part. And you pick up the, the flaming pins and throw them at him in the face. And sometimes the game doesn't register it, because it likes to be a butthole. Dang it. Oh, got him. There we go. And then you just hit him. <laughs> I guess I hit him with my levitation ball. I wasn't thinking what I was doing. I thought I had shield there. I guess that would make sense, though. Alright, I'm gonna put shield on. I'm gonna keep it there for the rest of the game. I think. Because um, really, like... The first time I played this, I kind of forgot that I had shield, and it was like, really useful, you know? That shield will last a long time, especially with the upgrade it gets. There we go. Sometimes the hit doesn't register until after he swings his weapon. Okay. But he has, he has the same attacks as always. They do slightly more damage now that, you know, he's on fire. Um, really, for the most part, he's kind of the same easy boss. And, like, p there are drops everywhere. Like, even if you don't have regeneration, you're going to be getting health out the butt. Alright, here we go. He's so dead. Falls into the pit of blades. And we're gonna have another cutscene here in a bit. Uh! Rasputin! I see your skull is as hard to penetrate as ever. Dad! <laughs> what is your brain doing out here in this tank with this other brain? And who are all these unconscious people? What have you gotten yourself involved with, psychics? He's been cavorting with filthy, cheating psychics! <laughs> Is that really? Is that really how I look in your mind? Man, do I hate psychics! And seeing my son happy! <laughs> I don't hate psychics! I used my psychic connection with you to find you, and to project myself into your mind. But how can you hate me for being psychic? If you're psychic too! Son, I could never hate you. I only wanted you to be happy, Rasputin. And safe. Our family has many enemies. I have a lot more hair than that. Now, son, we have to carefully unweave your psyche from that other brain. We don't want anything bad to happen while your mind is in this tangled state. The damage could be permanent. Oh, snap. Unweave? Detangle? Never! 
I like it this way. I mean, look at how huge I am. And I think I can juggle now. <laughs> <laughs> this is your mind, so you are the strong one here. But I'm about to give you my son. You must take care of it, because it's everything I've got. Yeah, how about that for an upgrade right there? <laughs> <laughs>